I can play this in Japanese, dude. Oh my god, that would be scuffed. Scary game. sensitivity for ants. Do a head bob? Dude, this fucking, um, this camera is, oh my god, that looks so much, do we, do we want it or do we not want it? I kind of don't want it. It looks a little heavy, but. You know what, I'm going to keep it. No, I don't want to quit. Okay. Uh, you need that. Slept well. Okay, hold on. I'm really getting used to this. This is really weird. Okay, and uh, the stepping is really strange. Tap it, and you just fucking go forward. Alright. It is dark outside, you're not wrong. Oh shit. Wait, do I have inventory? Do I What what is going on here? I'm so confused. Okay, here we go. Yes. Do I bring this into the toilet? I don't know. I'm supposed to take this. I just picked it up. Wait. Oh, I can drop stuff. Okay. that there. I don't know what I'm doing. There's no one to check though. Really quickly. Actually, there's a shift. Yes. Okay. Considering this is the convenience store, I'm assuming we're going to the convenience store. So we'll just go downstairs. I need to eat something, change, and grab a flashlight. Okay, well I have the flashlight. How do I change? Alright. So, this means... Interact. Whoop. Yes. Okay, here we go. Just look at this game. Yeah, 
just over an hour. It's uh, 11.35 Eat Bento. Alright, we have the flashlight, we ate. Now we in this bitch? Gonna get crunk? The fuck? I can't shut the door. Am I supposed to go back here? That's too fucking dark, fuck that shit. Okay, so with every one of these, I don't like, that's the only thing I don't like about these games, is like, you think there's a knife right here, but in reality it's just like the glare off of like a uh, freezer or something. Christ. I would never walk in a neighborhood like that. Oh, whoa. Maybe I'm not supposed to go down this way? It's really fucking dark. Damn it, I'm sorry, I'm getting interrupted for some reason. Okay, now we go. Here we go, we got 7 11, bro. We need a sword. I know what really happened here. I was called to warn you all by the name I cannot speak of. The day of judgment will come. Hiya! Wait, is he bleeding? God, you made it. Oh no, it's just that I recently heard someone had fall, fell off a bridge you just crossed. It was an old lady that said he saw, she saw a man walking down the street with his legs completely bent the other way. Scary stuff. If only this was true. Ha ha. Ha. Sorry. Alright, am I coming in? What's going on here?
Okay, I think I'm supposed to throw these to the I'm gonna put them over here for now. Seems like a normal day in the day in the life of a guy working at a gas station or a gal working at a gas station. That shit off the clock? This dude swagger. Holy shit. Did homeboy we oh he left. This this is my shift. Oh shit. Is there an inventory button? Thanks, player. Dude, employee of the month, dog? Sheesh. I can't move my back cameras. All right, we'll find something to do right now. Yeah, yeah, I already did that. I think I did that. I 
How do I grab this though? Maybe it's not maybe it's not time to Prank on me in the front here. This is one pack of cigarettes. Damn, this must be popular as shit. Hey, what the fuck was this? I don't know what this means. Oh, hey, I'll give it a try. Okay, well. Well, is that guy still here? Oh, shit. I need to take this order. This is my package? Take it home? That's really fucking weird, but... What the fuck? See what's up. Am I supposed to be at work right now? I don't have food in the food. Wait. Nope. Maybe I can eat these? Okay, I'm probably supposed to just go back to work right now. Considering there's no lights in this time, it's really fucking scary. Like, what do these scares do?
fuck, I think I made a bad mistake. Oh, no, I didn't. Ah, yes. It's a beautiful day in this neighborhood, am I right, guys? This is me running, by the way. Okay, so I heard you reported that the doors would open on their own. We gotta gotta check the sensor, and it seems like the wiring's were loose. Oh, you thought it was some sort of poltergeist? I see those on TV all the time, but they're all scripted. Ghosts aren't real after all. You're not wrong, bro. Saw some rats behind the store yesterday. Someone must have left the garbage bin open. The first person to see this now has to get rid of the rodents ASAP. Your manager. What the fuck? And he just walking out? You didn't even tell me what to do? Aw, oh, shit. Alright. He saw that shit and did not fucking tell me anything. I'm gonna go in the back to check it. What am I supposed to do? So like beat their ass or something? Oh, he's leaving. Okay. Huh? Ah. Here we go. Get pissed on, nerd. Did you say I'll my, my co-worker left with a quickness? Oh shit! I can't run! Oh my fucking god, it's an old lady. Not that that's bad. I didn't mean to say it like that. Oh my This fuck, this exhilarating gameplay. Holy shit. Loving it. Do you think I got time? I don't want to lose a customer though. Oh yeah, we got time. Like, oh my god, I broke my back. Oh, you, you need to put a wet floor sign down. <laughs> okay. Where are you rats at? Where are you at, rat it to me? Fuck. I don't see another rats. Here we go. Nay, on. Literally, nay, nay. Fuck. Alright. Oh! Hey! I'm coming! Hey, what's going on, brother? What was that? Five cans of beer. What? Hmm. Yeah. 
I understand. Is it back here? Am I supposed to get it back here? Like, where am I supposed to get this shit at? Actually have to do this? Oh my god! Why, why didn't he get it himself? This is literally the. Like, this literally takes zero effort. Five cases of beer and a pack of cigs, right? Dude, the immersion is so real in my hotel. I have to like spit in people's faces. I was gonna make. I was about to make a really fucking weird joke, and I just don't want to make that anymore. Please fetch me five cans of beer and a pack of cigar. Five cans of beer? I have the beer. I literally just picked it out for you. Uh, I'll just get him the cigars and then see where we go from there. Has to be like some sort of glitch that I'm like missing. Oh, I fucking I dropped it. Here, motherfucker. Oh my god. Chat, I'll tell you right now, I don't give a fuck if I was at my job or not. I would make this dude. I would be like, you can bounce, homie. Fuck out of here. Go to the speedway down the street, get boosh. Alright, let's find these rats. If they're still here. I don't think so. I don't know where the fucking two other rats are, though. house. What did you do? How dare you? <clears throat> Just afraid this bitch with rat poison. <sighs> Dude, there's no shot. Like... Yeah, that was that lady leave. Fuck off. It's like I don't want this number on my screen anymore. Why are these in like the most intricate places though? Like Oh shit, I'm clipping in. Dude, got it done. Hog you. Catching that shit on CCTV. What? What the? F the 
Somebody's playing a trick. It's a little kid. It looks like a ghost, though. Dead ass. Another package for little old me, you say? This music is cold though, I don't know. different underwear holy shit <clears throat> wait damn did you see that drift you see that? holy shit Stuck on a barrier. Let's see something. Whoa! Oh shit, that sends shivers out my spine, dude. What? Oh, it's raining. Oh shit. Okay, so another tape. Watch closely, chat. Thing, monk of fucking ass. That's some creepy ass shit. Rain pattern right there, boys. Oh, 
Where's the homie at? Oh my fucking god! You bastard! <laughs> she. Your fucking face, you bastard! Oh Jesus Christ! Products were missing on the shelves. Always keep the shelves full. That's our motto. So please restock them by tomorrow morning. You're mean it. But yeah, get the fuck out of you, scary ass weed. Dude, that was scary as fuck. That wild ass shit. Alright. This Raymond? The fuck is this? Ramen. Sorry. I'm leaving. Are you fucking kidding me? Panicking. Uh oh. Dude, what? Oh no. I really hope it's not that pissed and pissy fucking cuck lord Andy over here. There's something wrong with the air conditioning. Your boss seems desperate at keeping the food fresh. I hate to be working this late, but he pays me well, you know. Don't mind me. I'll just quickly check the outside units and head right out. Alright, playboy. Don't bother me again. I probably should have checked what needed to be restocked, but I don't care, because I'm a very good employee. I pick shit up, I find where it goes, and I put it down. Okay, this I think I know where it goes. Yep. Easy clap. Wait, let me see that, what that guy's doing. God damn, this boy moving. Yo, look. The shit got torn down. That's it. Nope. Alright, 
Well, I could probably stock something else really quick if there is something else to stock. Are you gonna be stealing, bitch? <gasps> Is she stealing? I can't tell what she's doing. Oh, she was gathering shit. <laughs> I thought she was stealing. I was like, I don't know if I get paid enough for this. Hey, are you the only one working here? Can't believe this. What kind of a manager puts a girl on a midnight shift alone? I see you have no choice. Well, at the very least, I'll give you my protection charm. Now be careful. Aw, thanks. Yeah, fuck yeah, I'll take that shit. See, and I thought she was stealing. Now I'm an asshole. Fuck. Why isn't this one stocked up? I don't like that. Dude, that rain is so well. You would not fucking believe it. Now the AC works. I don't know why I'm opening the AC, but I kind of want to. Uh oh. Oh. I'm gonna make sure there's no customers in here first. I'm a good employee. No shit. Fuck. I'm stuck in a shitter. No way. What the fuck? Bitch. Team! I'm really scared to look at the CCTV bin, but I have to. Because I don't know if... She's still in the store. Oh, so she fucked up my camera.
Can I pick that shit up? I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do at all. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a good employee. Pick up tow, tow. Wait, there's a talisman? Keeping this here. Let me see what else is out here. What kind of marks are these? Just got shit stains in their drawers. I can't even pick this up. Well, since, well, since that fucking door back there is locked, and we found a fucking key, I kind of want to use it right now. Wait, should I bring the talisman first? Yeah. Monka fuck S. Door is still locked, right? I think so. Now I just need to get the key. Dude, the boss is going to be so shitty. Bring the key, fuck it. And real quick. If I exercise the door, does that mean that she has to be dead? Alright, well. You know what they say, YOLO. Exercise the door, bitch! so loud the entire time there was nothing that was silent about it what the fuck what a nightmare was it all a dream was it a dream no i went to work i clocked that shit in and i restocked bitch That door doesn't ever open. I don't know if that's our neighbor or not or what. Oh shit. Cat. Put 
I'm ready to look closely. Yes. That looked like the fucking the door we exercised, or at least the ceiling. I think. All right, chat. Third night. Let's go to work. There's really no way to get down this fast, not down here. Like, why is? I do, I'm getting tired. I'm gonna see this bitch through though. Look at this flashlight though, it's just the eminence of like 30 circles. I like it though, still cool, it's kind of scary. Back at it again, baby. <laughs> Hold up. Looking for that dude. Where's my motherfucking coworker? He was an ass hat yesterday, I think. Unless that was a dream. What is all this shit? This is nails? <laughs> oh, no shot. Get out. There's two kids here. And the back camera isn't working. Oh, I see what's happening. No, I don't. Wait, these are all TVs. We can stock, though. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Guess we need to see if those little boys need, or little girls or boys, or whatever the fuck they are, if they need some shit. 
What the fuck is outside, bro? Yes, we turn one on at each island wave. What? Why does it keep doing that? Wait, did they cancel out? Oh, I'm supposed to wait for these motherfuckers to look at this shit. Maybe I can sprint over real quick and get that motherfucker to look at that shit. He didn't look at- oh. Does he need to look at specific ones? I saw somebody. Wait, I need to see where he's gonna go, and then I need to turn the TVs on. Like, where he stops at. Dude, I keep clicking the button like it's gonna change my thing. He walks in the front. In the front of the first aisle. The last aisle. Stops right here and he looks up at the left TV on the top TV. Stops fifth, the third aisle. That's right. When he's going around here, I'm gonna turn that last TV on. Once he starts hitting this corner right quick, like boom.
just gotta get him. What? Okay, so those turned off. And they stayed off. Why? Am I supposed to do that for everything? I think. Oh. Where'd he go? Okay, well since he's gonna turn that one, I can only assume that there's like three of them right here. What the fuck? I'm so confused. What is going on here? Wait. Actually. I don't know what to do. I'm looking at the TVs and I can't figure out what the fuck is going on. There's no, there's like a pattern. Am I supposed to turn on one TV? Or all four? Okay, he's looking at the moon. Top and middle. I'm gonna try that. Okay. Not even one of them was right, man. What the fuck? Dude. Wait. Fuck. I don't think I'm gonna make it in time. Top, 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 top. No big deal, easy fix. I 
How do I turn this off, though? So it's got to work for each aisle. I just need to know what the middle one is. Wow, this is actually this is. This, I didn't think I was going to go into a puzzle game like that. Holy shit! sound of it going do 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 is me getting two of them wrong instead of all four. So I have two of them right, but all, well, so one's wrong. I wish I could zoom in closer to this. Jesus. So I got two of them wrong, I think. What the fuck? I'm dead ass, let's Google this shit. This is taking up way too much of my fucking time. No. No, turn it off, please. I'm dead ass about to Google this shit. This is this is extremely fucking hard. It's five in the fucking morning. I thought this was gonna be an easier game. And you you can't zoom any more than this. I'm sorry. This fucking shit. He's looking straight down. Aisle three. Left side of the first TV. Third TV middle. Can't tell if he's looking over fucking down. If I don't get it in there within the next five tries, I'm fucking just not even joking.
Motherfucker. Now I'm just gonna do it anyway. Kids being picky as fuck. Oh shit, I clicked the click the click button. Which way is this mother You know what? Actually I wanna do this. This is gonna fucking help me out about fifteen times thousand. Yeah, fuck that. Oh, I clicked it again. <laughs> Hopefully this fucking helps just a little bit. Jesus Christ, I don't think I should need this much help in the fucking game. Straight down. TV on the bottom, but don't. He's looking up. All right, we're getting there. Oh shit! I should probably get the last one. Yeah, that grain is way too fucking heavy. They're, holy shit. I would have never fucking guessed it. Jesus fuck. Do all of them? Boom. 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 Okay. Okay. These look like bloody nails. I'm so confused. That was the weirdest scary sound effect I've ever heard.
Jesus. Thank God I didn't Google that shit. I would have ruined that shit for myself. Fuck me. Wait, what? Is there another box? Hold on, chat. shit. Jesus. Oh, dude. Jesus. Good shit though. Definitely a good game. Uh, jump scares are decent. Ending was the there was ending two. I didn't get any one. I don't know what that was or three. I don't know if there was a third, but I'm gonna find out in a minute on YouTube. But um, 
graphics were still good though. I was really surprised at that. Even even going outside as well as the dark is really really nice. I like that. Uh, kind of ends up climax two, ending two. But dude, that manager scene though, fuck no. That audio was all in my ear. Take me back to my main menu. Okay. The convenience store. Oh, I need to, I want to uninstall this though. Wait. How many endings are there? Wait, what? Wow. And what's up with the 720p though? Why didn't I? I didn't look around. I just looked straight at it. Oh my. God. I think I was too eager to watch it. I was like, oh shit.
What's up with this weird background noise in this video? I was sickened by the whole situation. I sealed the VHS carefully, decided to send it off to the center. Fortunately, the center's address was in my box. I felt tense, shoulders relaxed. Too much had happened. The short span my mind couldn't keep up any light of rest, but couldn't fall asleep. The store terrified and everybody had to sit down in the chair and quit my head. What did I see? Was that the real witness? Damn! I don't know why, so I turned the internet about the store. I found a few old articles and forums talking about the location of where the building was made. One comment on a strange forum stood out to me. It said, There seemed to have been gruesome killings at the property. I searched for the same user's comments in 2009. There was a case where a man who was the mainstay of the family committed a murder-suicide. I determined to investigate the further incident. September 14th, the man killed his child with a kitchen knife while his wife was off to a grocery shopping, it's like off to a grocery shopping to a local supermarket. When the wife came back and said that she was killed in an extreme way, he then hung himself on the same day. They say that the woman was pregnant at the time of her death. The woman was killed with several nails pictured on onto her along, punctured onto her along with her child in her stomach. I wanted to throw up at the obscene images, but I knew I had to continue. There was a guy that replied to the comment and said that he worked at the same place as him. According to him, the man was often harassed by his boss at work, and he had complained to several colleagues, and on the day of the incident, it is said that he had an emotionless face. Imagining what the family had gone through, depression and hatred occupied my head. It was very painful with tears in my eyes. I closed the internet gently and called the manager to talk about everything I had experienced during the night shift and what I had discovered. However, the calls were never picked up. It was the same over and over again. Then I received a phone call from Mr. Hozo, the franchise leader who I had never met. I had a fad, bad feeling about it. Then with a shivering voice he said, the manager is dead. I couldn't breathe so it wasn't a dream. And when I was asked about the place where he was found, Mr. Hozo said there was an old storage behind the convenience store and he was found there after a day of his death. I dropped my phone. I quit my part-time job with a broken feeling. After quitting, I would avoid going near the convenience store whenever I could. Because every time I passed in front of the store, I would always feel sharp stare towards me and I wouldn't be able to help them to try to pass as quickly as possible so as not to look at the building. A day later, the store had closed down. The reason seems to do to poor management, but further details were not publicized. At the point, I didn't have means or courage to examine it. After a while, the members of the convenience store had, be, had hazed down a bit. One day, I passed by the closed down store to heard the child's voice. Then I, there I saw a woman. When I looked in my hand, I had picked up one of the rusted nails that had fallen in the middle of the store. Middle of the site. What the fuck? <laughs> what is this ending? That fucking. Doo -doo -doo. Head ass. <sighs> Alright. Chat. I'm gonna fucking go to bed. It was nice chilling with y'all. Like I said, um, maybe tomorrow, because I'm really fucking hooked on this shit. I'm thinking about, and I get paid tomorrow, so we can buy even more. Um, what was it? The one I wanted to buy? The caregiver. Stigmatized property, and either Alkimanto or missing children. One of those three, or all of four. So, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Love, peace, chicken grease. Till we get it cracking like glass on the floor. I'll see you tomorrow.